I'm Katie B. Welcome back to my channel. All about me! A place where I get to be my true, weird, saucy, spicy, authentic self. Hotheads official! Check them out. Not the sauce that we're reviewing, but it is the sauce that we're shouting out. I've heard some of you say now, Katie B, is this, is this really you? No one could truly be that strange and quirky. And I assure you that I have a very disappointed mother out there somewhere that can completely confirm this is authentic legit. Anyway, I know the part of you is here for me, but the other part of you is here for the sauce. So without further ado, I'm indecisive, baby. Oh, babe. I require you. Why? I can't decide which sauce that I want to review from Pex Peppers because Garrett Pet, the owner and creator of Pex Peppers, was so generous to send me this ginormous box that I can't decide what sauce to review for all of my fans. Well, let me look in your box. Dogecoin to the moon. Like and share this video if you agree. Doge to the moon. Some of you are out there waiting on Elon to say it. KT said it. And that is all that matters. They just want you to try the sauce. To Pluto. Stop talking. D-O-G-E. Do your lemon, lemon yellow jacket. Alrighty then, the boy has spoken. Thank you, that's it. Exit. Lemon yellow jacket. As previous stated, I have reviewed a few other sauces from Pex Peppers. I love these guys. They make a killer sauce. They are incredibly legendary, historic, if you will. They have delicious sauces. They know what they're doing. They've been around for a long time. Um, I'm really excited to be able to like sample all these in the lineup because I've heard like I've sampled three sauces previously of, no, four of Pex Peppers. They're delicious. They all range in heat. They range in flavor. They range in texture. And I, um, you know, always hear about Pex Peppers. So really excited to get the opportunity to go through this big ass box. Without further ado, the boy has picked Lemon Yellow Jacket, which I for one am uber excited about. Um, this just seems like it's gonna be really good. It's made with lemon fatali. I love the lemon flavor and I love fatali peppers. Uh, we also have a beautiful yellow color going on right here. So really excited. What do we have? Ingredients are yellow fatali mash, which is yellow fatali chilies, vinegar, vinegar, wildflower honey, lemon juice. Side note, uh, can't go without saying we want to thank Grandpa, who was a beekeeper, encouraged the business, encouraged Garrett Peck, and is also the reason that we have signature wildflower honey in all the sauces, if not almost. Um, see what we got here on the side. Let me hold the bottle. Pex Peppers Lemon Yellow Jacket will sting your tongue with the ferocity of a yellow jacket, backed with the sour tang of honey and lemon. Uh, this sauce utilizes the brutal but flavorful yellow fatali chili pepper to provide an electric sting, followed by the sweet wildflower honey. Lemon Yellow Jacket goes great on fish, chicken, pork, and so much more. Beware as you will get stung by the yellow jacket. I graduated as a yellow jacket, BT dubs. Um, let's see here, oh Lord help. Colorado proud and down here on the heat indicator scale, this is a nine out of a 10. It says mouth on fire spicy. It also says visit us at pexpeppers.com. <clears throat> and that break in my voice is because it's a nine of 10. And while I have not sampled tons of sauces from Pex Peppers, I can tell you that when I have had the hot sauce is a hot sauce. Like sometimes heat indicator scales are a suggestion. They're an opinion. Uh, and um, yeah, yeah, Garrett Peck, the maker of Peck's Peppers, makes a hot sauce. So any hittle, anyhow, beautiful color. I love it. It's unique. Uh, usually hot sauces, you know, are like red and brown. And so this is a lovely color. It's Deviates from the norm. We have a few chunky monkeys in there. Uh, let's see what we smell like. Oh God. Immediately smell the pepper. <laughs> oh. 
Oh, you need to go back in time for my last review. My last review, like the sauce tasted like a granny, a spicy granny Smith apple. It was absolutely delicious. That was bee bomb. This is going to be completely polar opposite. That's hot. Vinegar, wildflower, honey, lemon juice. This is pretty straightforward. This is predominantly peppers. The things I do for validation and likes. Let's do it. Watch me suffer. Just please like, share, subscribe. And if not, then just go out and buy Pex Peppers because they're good. I like them. All right. My big lot spoon. Always got to have the big, big lot spoon from the big lots down yonder in Rock Hill, South Carolina on Cherry Road. You walk on in there, you tell them you want one of your very own. They won't know what in the hell you're talking about, but it don't matter. Let's pour. Ooh, it's bloopy. It's ploppy. Um, hmm. Yep, that looks scary. Oh, it's big and beefy. <gasps> Why'd I do that? I have control issues. Okay, here we go. I'm bracing. That's hot. Why'd I do it? I don't know why I did it. Oh, it's got a lemon zestiness. Reporting to you live from hell. There's some honey in here. There's some lemon in here. There's some hiccups and pain in here. It's a hot sauce. Ow, it's hot. Ow. It's hot. I'm not crying, just my eyeballs are sweating. Oh, um. Ow. Oh. Okay, I wanted to make sure that I lick everything off the spoon. I definitely taste all three of the ingredients in there. And definitely, well, four. <gasps> Ow! Including the Fatali peppers. Which are incredibly painful. Uh, I would definitely say that this is a nine of a ten, but I will say that... <gasps> Ow! I will say this. <sighs> it's hotter than 40 hells. Which, when Pex Peppers decides to make a hot sauce, it's a hot sauce. Much like, <coughs> much like that's a hot sauce. But, oh God, my nose is running. I think I have to pee. Is this a panic attack? Oh God, it's fine. I'm fine. We're fine. Fine. It's okay. I think it's already burned a hole in my stomach. I don't feel it there anymore. It's now filtering through my bloodstream. It's just burning and itching all over. It's fine. We're fine. Okay. I will say this, it is hot and I'm slobbering and stuff. But I will say in all honesty, it has a great flavor to it. Sauce is on fire. Um, yeah, it's on fire. I just can't say anything else. It is a hot, hot sauce, but the flavor of it's delicious and everything that's listed can be taste. That's not always the case. Sometimes there are things listed in sauces and you can't taste them. But in this, I will definitely say the ass kicking punch, the bee sting of the Fatali peppers, first and foremost, very lemony, very fresh. <laughs> that sort of zestiness and acidity mixes very well with the peppers. Great burn. The honey is in there. It's perfect balance. Um, all in all, delicious sauce. Got a beautiful body to it. And I always sample sauces off of the spoon, which makes them like a million times hotter. So you guys get to laugh at my slow descent into madness. However, if you take a sauce like this and put it on chicken, fish, uh, I would say on a white meat. Personally, I think that this would be really good. If you go and do that, a lot of the heat sort of cooks out of it. And so you're left with more of the flavor than the spice. And furthermore, I'm insane. You don't have to follow everything that I do in your personal life. Just follow everything I do on social media. <laughs> anyway, it is really good. Super good. Uh, after I whew, kicked my own ass with that first spoonful, uh, definitely the flavor can come through. It's nice. It's sweet. It's zesty. It's lemony. Oh God. I'm definitely a fan. Super good sauce. Uh, so go out there yourself, get you some. If you like spicy, if you like zesty and tangy and zingy, then you need to go to www.bexpeppers.com and get you some of this delicious sauce. 
Come back tomorrow. I got a whole box here to go through. So, good luck.